war is a problem. It's good for growth, but it's not good for human well-being as a whole. Most economists have not thought deeply about war and peace. There is a compelling case for departures from business as usual economic policy. Your economy is bigger if you're spending more money on arms. Even if those arms are being used to kill people and in the process the arms are being destroyed, well then you have to spend more on more arms. We as economists need to actually think about how the policies we recommend impact on people's well-being in a multi-dimensional way. Whether and when and how and to whom to give resources with what conditions attached and how those economic policies are impacting the balance of power between competing groups. Groups that in turn are often mobilized against other groups in society. The goal is not merely to move the money, but also building a durable peace. But how does one put a value on peace, on biodiversity, on clean air? Just because something doesn't carry a price in the market doesn't mean it's not valuable. These things are not inconsequential for human welfare. And at the end of the day, human welfare is what economics should be about.